For now, I've been put under the expert guidance of Zheng. If anyone can speed teach me this incredible art, he's my man. In his 20 years as a dim sum chef, he'll have made well over two million of these tricky little parcels. But there's one small problem. So, he doesn't speak any English at all? No. I'm screwed then. Nothing at all. Hello, good morning. No, I'm <laughs> fucked. Okay. <laughs> Luckily, Fuchsia's on hand to translate his instructions. Hi. Good to see you. Good morning. So, what is this? Rice flour? Okay. My first lesson is how to make a prawn filled potato flour dumpling called hagao. Fold it in. Uh, Just like pasta, the secret to good dim sum is as much about the wrapper as the filling. That's what's going to hold all the flavour and moisture in. Hard. So he's going to show you how to press the skins now right. from the dough. Press the skins. Unlike an Italian kitchen, there are no pasta machines in sight. So he's using the palm of his hand. My God. Fuck. They're beautiful, huh? They're so soft. Jung made it look easy. Now it's my turn. OK, use this, the finger of this hand to push it. This, your index finger of the right hand. Look, so you're holding this and just pinching, but okay. you push it with that finger. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, saying that it seems somewhat particularly difficult because of all this fine finger work, yeah. and you have to be a bit kind of calm and patient. And... Calm and patient. <laughs> yeah, I'm screwed straight away, right? <laughs> calm and patient. I can't remember being this nervous in the kitchen. And as any pastry chef will tell you, hot, sweaty hands are not what you need with all this delicate work. It's so intricate. So difficult. Jesus Christ. They're extraordinary. That is a lot fucking harder than it looks, I tell you. Such intricacy. And if I thought that was difficult, I hadn't bargained on Jung's next lesson. Chung Fun. Paper thin sheets of rice and potato flour batter wrapped around a choice of fillings. Fucking hell. It's really hot, so the most important thing with this is not to be afraid of scalding your hands in the steam. Right. Yeah. After just three minutes, the skin scorching paper thin sheets of batter are ready to be rolled. Sticking to the cloth like shit to a blanket. I haven't felt this clumsy since I first set foot in a kitchen 20 years ago. The real killer is to wrap the filling tightly without splitting it. OK. <laughs> Fuck me, that was hard. I mean, seriously hard. Very intricate. It's all in the manipulation of the dough.